I researched master's degrees and I found STS. And it sounded like the most interesting thing you could do. It was, it was English, it was promoted as being international, which it, which it really was for my cohort. And um, it was social science, but it, was, it seemed like more than that, and which kind of fit perfectly for, for me. And I applied and I got in and uh, it turned out to be probably one of the better decisions that I made in my life. I think I had quite soon the feeling that it's something that is more than just doing research on something just because you're interested in, but that there's another side that really does something with the with the results. So it was a rather political question, and I thought that was, I think that was what kept me with STS. I think what is different coming from an STS background is that you have a deep and basic understanding of how science functions and works. Of course, that's, that's different in, in, in different fields, of course, that it's different in, in different nation states. Uh, in Vienna, it's different than, than for the, in the UK and other stuff. But you get at least um, tools uh, that uh, allow you to quickly get the knowledge of how the system works, which really helps you a great deal. I feel really appreciated for, for what I bring into this organization and for my, because I know my perspective is unique and they know it. So I, I know always that I can bring this specific uh, flavor to a, a project proposal, for instance. What I like about being an academic in SDS is that there is a rather large possibility to connect with all kinds of different disciplines. On average, maybe STSs uh, are a little bit more passionate about what they do. And maybe it's a function of being a relatively young field that most people make a sort of conscious choice to sort of go into at one point, rather than you start at it as an undergraduate and you sort of just kind of mm. do one step after the other. That there seems to be a sort of sense of curiosity mm. and passion that is kind of characteristic, certainly not just of SDS, but that I think that's one of the things that first drew me to SDS. If I have only studied, like if I would have stayed within plant production uh, with my studies and used the plant production lens to look at the problems we are faced with and the situations we try to, uh, to deal with, um, then I think many of uh, the, the tools that help me to understand what is really going on would not have been there. I would maybe have had much more this uh, transferist perspective of, okay, we have a problem there, solution is more technology. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, there I think I'm much more able to really see that in a more nuanced way, in a more complex way, which is basically what we are faced with complexity. Mm -hmm.